Welcome back World of Tanks fans. Where today we come to you with World of Tanks and a special day where the PS4 beta has launched today. That's an open beta so anybody with a PS4 has been waiting to get into tanks you can go to the game store get into the new games it's right on the top get it downloaded when you start you'll be set up with 200 gold to get going on you'll have uh, I don't have access to it now things are, seem to still be downloading and taking considerable time but you will get a special edition T1E6 PS which I believe is pretty much the same as the Xbox One version of the special edition T1E6 and of course you'll get the Locus PS which might have a special camouflage on it unfortunately it's taken forever to download and screw waiting for it we want to get into playing tanks um, in the open beta right now there's only three nations to mess around with America German and Soviet Union the trees don't look like they're completed at all um, there is no tier 10 goes up to tier 8 on all nations that are available and it looks like there are some splits in the tree that are missing as, as well I don't remember the German line looking quite so shabby looking there's a lot more tanks that should be there in the middle uh, there's no other premiums to choose from right now back to the garage here uh, you can of course do all of your consumables always remember to press triangle to change your currency from the gold also your consumables if you want to use large repair kit and you don't want to spend gold put it in your menu and then press triangle of course I don't have enough money to buy that right now so of course I can't buy it but make sure you change a currency if you want to use those large repair kits and not spend gold on them simple simple of course I can't load up with anything so reset that I will change that though again this is available on PS4 it is open beta can find it in the game store under new games it's right on the top so let's get into a quick battle here with let's go let's go with the MS you also get seven vacant slots so of course use those wisely and make sure you know what line you want to work before before you take right off that way if you come to where you're selling tanks you're selling tanks that you really don't need at least that's what I try to do anyway try to work on one line at one point in time I was sporadic on my decisions of tanks and I was all over the trees and all the nations and really don't get too far unless you have a lot of premiums under your belt like on Xbox version I have over 35 premiums so it's easy to bank cash for extra tanks We'll get going, see how it plays out on PS4. I 
play on PC and Xbox One, and both of those versions are quite crisp and play quite nice. I gotta say, it doesn't really look much different than Xbox One. It actually looks a little bit more lacking in looks. That could be just me, though. Too used to looking at the Xbox. I must get used to this, I'm sure I'll be changing my mind. Here's another tip. Change your... Change your map on, um... Down in your game, go to toggle mini-map. You get that nice square map like they use on the, uh... Like they use on the PC version. And, ready. and of course you get the full view, you know. If I can get him to battle for everybody's dead. Talked and messed around so much. But I am happy that all the PS4 players and PlayStation players finally get to play tanks. Anybody that's been waiting for a long time to play it, well, now's your chance. Soon. Kept my lips shut though. <laughs> yeah, let's go into another one. Let's start getting some silver built up on this PS4 profile. Of course, Xbox, I've been playing that since its days on the beta, so I'm up to many, many tanks in my garage in that version. Let's go with a tractor. I always like using that. It's got a pretty powerful gun, if I remember right. Let's have a look. Yeah, let me know all about that. That looks like they're gonna set set us up with the most powerful. Like, yeah, we want you to start spending as soon as possible. <laughs> all right, let's see what we can do with this thing. Probably do some good stuff with it if it's got the cannon on it. I should have checked with cannon, but if it's got the cannon, I'm thinking it's good on it. We gotta, we gotta do pretty good damage wise. Of course, anybody that follows my Xbox gameplay seen the many tanks that I have. And a lot of times you'll see me rolling around with premiums just because I have so many of them. But don't go into it thinking premiums give you the upper hand. Don't go spending a lot of money thinking premiums will give you the upper hand. Just if you're into collecting the tanks, and of course, by all means, buy them all. But never buy a tank thinking you're going to have the upper hand because you'll be sadly mistaken. I mainly I mainly use my premiums as gold I mean uh silver harvesters. If I'm down on silver if I wanna farm silver really quick. I'll just run my line of premiums all day and just build up silver until I get my desired amount. <sighs> this don't have the gun I was thinking. I'm gonna change a package on this. This is a good cannon, but Seems a little, a little bit lacking. 
Good teamwork, though. It's effective. Oh. I've been seen. I've been seen. Come on. Go, 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 little tang. Go. Heading right for the base. They're probably thinking the same thing. I'll get to their base just as the whole crowd gets to, gets to mine. Yeah, I can do it. Looks like I wanted to zero in there for a second. Might be a little bit of a bug. He's behind that mountain. What am I doing? Loaded and ready. Yeah, I'm way out of range. One thing I don't like about these automatics is range is very limited on some of them. As far as performance-wise, it seems to seems to perform like all the other versions. This tank actually seems like maybe a wee bit faster in this version than the ones I'm used to. I don't use this tank a lot anyway. I'm always in the upper tiers. Of course, tiers five and six are probably my favorites. Way out of range. All right, going down the, going down the hill. Always remember, go down the hill sideways. Right yeah, come and get your boys. Oh, bad idea. Bad idea. Ooh, there's a big. There are some slight issues with. There seem to be some slight issues with aiming. Transitioning from aiming to going back to tank view it seems like it freezes up every once in a while. But of course, that's what the beta's for, and that's why it's here. To fix that stuff, so when the full masses get their hands on it, they'll have. All new things to complain about instead of these issues. Training ops unlocked. Oh, isn't that wonderful? So, like I said, Open Beta is out live now on PS4. So, PS4 players get out there and download. Maybe we'll see you on the battlefield. Over and out.